Hello guys, welcome to Kodo. Today we will see how to read XML file into Oracle as well as I will show you how to insert this XML values in Oracle table using a procedure. So let's get into the video. I have created this XML file. It has a DB as root element and under that it has multiple subroot elements like info, occupation and under which it has some more sub elements like name, address, company. So let's see how we can uh, pass this XML file in Oracle. I have already inserted this XML uh, into the temp request table, which has two columns, ID and in request. Uh, I have taken ID column for my reference and we have this I request column, which has our XML as you can see over here. We will use extract value to pass the XML. It takes two parameters, source and path. In our case, source will be in request column where our XML is stored. And in request column has clocked data type. That's why I'm using this XML type. Okay. Next will be the path of the element that we want to read, say ID. So path for element ID will be db slash info slash ID and let us name it as id from temp request table now let's run and see output okay here we got correct id 001 uh, let's check in xml yes it's 001 let me read second element now that is address just uh, copy paste this line and uh, change uh, ID to address. We have got address as Mumbai, uh, which is correct. And same way, let's read next element or uh, contact. We have read contact also. We are done with all sub elements of tag info. Let's quickly move to occupation and uh, let's read tag experience. We have to change info to occupation and after that uh, your yeah, experience will come. Let's do for name now. Uh, here we have to take it as service slash company slash info one slash name. So now let's uh, run this and check output. Okay, we have got the output ABC private limited, which is correct. Let me do same for uh, address and year. Uh, we have got output uh, address is Delhi and year is 2001. Let's uh, move to last element that is salary uh, which has one attribute CCY and its value is INR. So we will read it first and then we will read the salary this uh, 10,000. Uh, now whenever you are reading an attribute uh, you have to uh, write it as at the rate attribute name. It is at the rate CCY. Uh, 
I think I made some mistake over here. Let's run this. Uh, we have got our output. Next step is uh, what we will do is we will create this table named my XML data, which contains all columns uh, that we we have just uh, extracted from XML. This table is currently empty. Uh, so now what we will do is we will write the procedure uh, to insert all the extracted data into this table. In this procedure, we have simply inserted XML data into our table. Now we will compile and then execute this procedure by passing input parameter as 1. Uh, actually here this input parameter does not require because uh, my table my temp table contains only one record. But uh, if your temp table contains more than one record, then you can uh, use this input parameter in where condition of select query to fetch particular record. Now let's uh, check the output. Here we got message that data inserted successfully. Uh, now let's check in my XML data table whether data was successfully inserted or not. Uh, yes, this data has been inserted successfully. So that's it guys and yeah, thank you for watching.